boom. There we go. What's up, everyone? It's the People's Fit Coach, and here's our workout for today. What we're doing right now is what I call the anatomy of a burpee. Now, there are very different ways that you can do this, but I'm going to do the more modified version, first of all. So what we do is we take five exercises, and then we pretty much just kind of like Voltron. We just take them piece by piece by piece by piece by piece, put it together, and create this monster called a burpee. All right, so let's do the modified version first off. First thing you're going to do is that what we call a drop and push. For the drop and push, you got to make sure that you use your core. Make sure it's tight. Every time you go down, you got to tighten up in order to push back up. So what you're going to do is kind of like an inchworm, except you're not going to keep walking out. You're just going down and you're pushing yourself back up. So it looks like this. I'm going to give you a side view. So basically, you tighten up, reach down, you stay here, you rock. You got a little bit of a rocking motion going right here. And then you just push back up. When you come back up, you gotta squeeze all of the posterior chain back. You squeeze your butt, squeeze your legs, squeeze your stomach, get back up. Okay? So it looks like this. Here, tighten, boom, stand up. Boom, tighten, boom, stand up. Now what you wanna do, make sure you get your hands under your shoulders. Don't reach out too far. Otherwise you might slide and your face plant. That's not part of it, okay? So don't do that. Alright, so that's the first exercise. That's the drop and push. After the drop and push, we go right into mountain jumpers, okay? So, mountain jumpers, you get down, shoulders over hands, knees under chest, and you're gonna press down to make things move. You press to move, press and move. So press, you're out. Press, come back up. Boom, 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 boom. Okay? So that's what you're gonna do. You gotta press down in order to straighten your body out. That's what's gonna help you elevate and get your feet back, by pressing. Not pushing, but pressing. Push, again, face plant, not a good look. All right, third exercise. Now, here we can either go right into a plank, a push-up plank, and just hold it still so you can get used to just keeping that core engaged. Just like this, stay tight. Or what you can do is go right into push-ups. All right, just doing your push-ups. All right, it's an either-or situation right there. So it just depends where you are with your athleticism, where you are physically. So maybe that plank could be challenging. Maybe it's not. If it's not, go right into those push-ups. After that, you're going to do another round of mountain jumpers. Okay? Once again, you're going to go back to doing the mountain jumpers. So now we have four exercises. We have drop and push. We have mountain jumpers, set one. Then we have the plank and or push-ups. Then we have mountain jumpers, round two. And now we're going to finish things off with a ground to sky squat. With a ground to sky squat, what you're going to do is push your hips back. Reach down like a sumo here, and you're gonna reach up in the air like you're popping a three-pointer. Ground to sky, boom, boom, round to sky. Now here's the thing about the ground to sky squat. You wanna make sure that you stay postured up. You don't wanna do this. You don't wanna do this. This is what we call in my class taking one for the team. When your head is down and your butt's up high, taking one for the team. No bueno. So posture up. So push those hips back, look ahead, chest is up and reach up. Every time you jump, point your toes to the ground, okay? So, there you have it, that's the fifth exercise. Then you just put them all together. What you're gonna do, you're gonna do one minute of each. Depend on your, your physical levels here. If you're a beginner, you're gonna go for about a minute, then you're gonna rest about a minute or two minutes. Depends, okay? If you're intermediate, one minute on, one minute off. If you're advanced, you got two choices. You can go one minute on with like 30 seconds of rest, or just go one minute, each one, no rest. Five minutes of work, okay? To top things off, you're gonna put it all together and go into the full on burpee. So boom, 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 reach up, boom. Boom, okay? And there you have it. It's the anatomy of a burpee. Form it like Voltron. So give it a try, let me know what you think, and check back here for more great workouts, more great exercises. This is People's Fit Coach, Sincere Hogan, saying, Eat like a warrior, train like a warrior, live like a warrior. Peace.